What's up Geeksters, it's me Omar from GeeksterLabs.com and today I have a really quick unboxing of a new subscription box that just got uh, dropped on my doorstep a little while ago which is from Funko. So this is the Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty uh, subscription box. So you guys are probably familiar with the other subscription box like Loot Crate and Nerd Block. Basically you pay a monthly fee for this one. It's $25, that does include shipping and, ha and uh, tax. Um, and it comes out to about 30, close to 35, a little under 35 bucks. So you pay that and every two months is what they'll send you a box with Star Wars goodness. And the cool thing about these boxes is that the, these are exclusive. So because it is Funko, these are pop figures. There'll be two pop, pic, pop, two pop figures, plus a t-shirt, plus a couple of other extra pieces that will be inside the box. And you can only get them through the subscription service. So kind of similar to the pop figures that they have, like a Hot Topic or a Target. Some of those items or some of those pop figures can only be purchased at those areas or those locations. So the pop figures in here can only be received if you are a subscriber to the Smuggler's Bounty. So I just got this in. It's probably gonna be pretty quick unboxing because I don't think there's too much stuff in here. But let's check it out and see what comes inside here, okay? Okay, so first off we have two pins, or no, one of them is a pin, one of them is a patch. Really nice looking. That's kind of a cool little, uh, we have a pilot here. Looks like a first order pilot with a cool like racing stripe, red stripes on it, that's interesting. And the pin is a Kylo Ren pin with some different language on the bottom there. And that's pretty cool. So it's a little pin, you can put that on your bag, your messenger bag, I might do that because I actually have a messenger bag which I keep my, my laptop and my camera stuff in. So I might pop that into there. So that's the first thing on the top of the thing. So pop this open, we also have, okay, so we have a lanyard here, which is probably something that for, for the little, a lot of you guys that go to the comic cons and the com comic book conventions, you can swap this out. So this is a Star Wars, The Force Awakens lanyard. It has a little uh, uh, stormtrooper on there, but like a pop figure size stormtrooper. So it's kind of cartoonish looking, that's pretty cool. We have a t-shirt, and so I, from what I understand, there's a, actually a couple different versions of this t-shirt. So let's pop this one open. I think it's Kylo Ren. I've seen a few other ones out there that are of, uh, I think, the um, the pilot or stormtrooper or some other character. So this one, that's pretty cool. So you actually give them your t-shirt your size and then they send you a t-shirt. So this one is a, a pop figure-esque Kylo Ren, which looks really cool on black. So I like that a lot. I might wear that to the movie when I go see it on December 17th, because I'm seeing it on Thursday. First showing at seven o'clock. And okay, so here we have the pop figures. All right, so these are the exclusive ones, and it actually says Star Wars Smuggler's Bounty exclusive on the top there, so that's kind of cool. So let's see here, we got two of them, they both look like first order people. So we have Captain Phasma, which I actually already have on my shelf right now, but this is the chrome version, so that's kind of cool. So a chrome version of Captain Phasma, which is pretty cool. These are bobbleheads, obviously, so these are from Pop Figures. This is number 91. So on the back, we have, oh, so we have TIE Fighter Pilot, TIE Fighter Pilot. So they're both the same set. One has the red stripes, which is kind of cool. I did not get that one. And then Captain Phasma is the one. And those are the three in this series of exclusives. So I'm assuming, depending on which smuggler bounty box you got, you may get one of the different TIE Fighters. So the TIE Fighter Pilot I have here is the all black one. So he's kind of like all shiny looking. And uh, so that's the one there. I kind of like the racing stripe one with the two red stripes. That looks kind of cool. Either way, it's pretty cool. So these are exclusives, like I said, that only come in the smuggler's bounty box. You can get these figures the non-exclusive ones from different places. Like I said, I already have the Captain Phasma, but it's not chrome like this one. This looks pretty pretty fancy, pretty sharp. And I, I'm pretty sure you can probably get a TIE Fighter Pilot, but I'm not sure what makes this one exclusive. There's nothing, it doesn't look anything exclusive. It looks kind of shinier than the average pop figures, but uh, I'm not sure besides that what makes it exclusive. So these are the things that came in this uh, month's Smuggler's Bounty. I subscribe to this uh, every month, so I'll be getting it in the next two months. I'll get another Smuggler's Bounty box. I'm assuming, to, uh, that once the movie comes out, there'll be a lot more pop figures and, and collectibles coming up because there are a few characters that we have not seen yet in the commercials and in the trailers. And so they've been really quiet on those. Like we haven't seen Luke, Luke Skywalker, uh, you know, uh, Supreme Leader Snoke, um, uh, Maz Kanata, I believe is her name is, um, the one that, it, that you can hear her voice speaking in the trailers talking about her eyes, I've seen your eyes, that character. I'm assuming there's gonna be a ton of new characters and toys and things that are gonna come out as soon as the movie drops. So hopefully the next Smuggler's Bounty will have a couple pop figures of those from the movie once it comes out. So anyways, guys, that's it for me today. If you have any questions about this uh, subscription box service or any things I showed you, put them down in the comment section below, and I'll see you in the next video review.